Hi there. Welcome to this tutorial from Lithus.com on the various interview questions related to the collections framework. In the previous videos, we looked at the overview of collection framework, what are the different interfaces which are present, what are the different classes which are present. Uh, in this video, we'll look at the Java list interface interview questions, what are the different uh, interview questions that might be asked about a list. And in the subsequent videos, we'll look at map and the set interfaces. So let's get started with the current uh, topic in hand, which is the list interface interview questions. So in this video, we'll look at things like array list vector. What are the differences between array and array list? What are the differences between array list and link list and those kind of stuff? Okay, let's start with the basic question. What is the difference between an array and an array list? Okay, the thing is array is a basic class in Java. So array is, sorry, it's not a basic, I mean, it's almost like a basic data type in Java. Whereas ArrayList is a class. ArrayList is a uh, really a class in Java. Uh, the most important difference between Array and ArrayList is that ArrayList is dynamic in the sense that I can add values to the ArrayList. I can remove values from ArrayList. I can uh, do uh, change the order of values in an ArrayList and do a lot of things with the ArrayList. However, the Array is static. Static in the sense you cannot change whatever values are present inside an uh, you cannot change the length of the array once the array is there so you can only change the values so i can say i can uh, declare an array of uh, like let's just say i clear create an array of this way so int uh, test is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 so this is how we initialize a basic array I can just call it static just because I'm outside. Oops. That's fine. Uh, once I've created an array of element f length 5, I cannot increase the length of it. So I, if I want to inc add another element to this array, the only way I can do that is by creating a new array called test1 or test2 and add the a new element copy this element copy the array there and add a new element you cannot increase or decrease the length of the array however i can change the values so test of zero is equal to five i can do that but i will never be able to change the length of this array so that's what we mean when we say array is static array list is dynamic in array list i can keep on adding and removing values whereas in an array you cannot really do that so that's the answer to the first question, what's the difference between array and an array list? Array is static, length cannot change, array list is dynamic, you can do a lot of operations, array list is a first class class in Java, whereas array is one of the fundamental data types in Java. So that's the basic difference between an array and array list. Next we would get into the other differences between array list and vector and array list and linked list. So first we'll get to the list interface. So, oops. The list interface offers all the methods which are related to adding by position. So I can say at this position, add this value. So at one, I want to add Kohli. At three, I want to add Lara. So these are the kinds of methods which the list interface provides. So the first question which we had is what is the difference between array list and vector? ArrayList is a basic implementation of the list interface. So you'd be able to add values, remove values, and do everything with it. So those are the kind of things that are possible in ArrayList. You can say, I, at this position, I want this value. At this position, I want to remove the value. I want to get the value at this position. So I want to get of 3 or get of 10. Those kind of things are possible using the ArrayList. So based on a position, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, whichever position you want to do. Vector is also very similar to ArrayList. Vector is exactly the same as ArrayList, except for the fact that a vector is uh, methods in vector are synchronized. What do you mean by synchronized? Synchronized methods only allow one thread to be running at a particular point in time. So when only one thread would be executing the method at one point in time. So this is very useful in a multi-threading environment. That's what is called thread safe. So all the methods in vector are thread safe synchronized methods uh, whereas the array list 
the methods are not synchronized so array list would cannot be used in a multi-threaded environment whereas a vector can be used so that's the most important difference between an array list and a vector so that's the answer to your question what is the difference between an array list and a vector the next question is what is the difference between an array list and a linked list so array list and linked list are both implementations of the uh, list interface however the biggest difference between an array list and a linked list is that a linked list implements a queue interface so it offers all the methods that a queue interface offers so you can do a peak a poll and those kind of stuff you can find out what is the element which is present at the first position what is the element which is present at the end of the uh, thing so it pr pr provides a little bit little bit more methods than the array list that's a different one however the most important difference is that in a linked list the elements are attached linked to each other so the first element has a link to second element second element has a link to third element so what happens is insertion and deletion becomes much more easier so if the first element has a link to the second element and i want to insert an element between these two then in a linked list it's very easy so insertion and uh, deletion are faster in a linked list than an array list however iteration is slower than array list so if i want to iterate around all values in the uh, linked list it's slower so the most important differences between array list and linked list is linked list also implements the queue interface linked list is faster in insertion and deletion linked list is slower than array list on iteration so these are the most important differences between an array list and a linked list and this is how the array list and a vector are different as well so those are the important interview questions related to the list interface in the next set of videos we'll look at what are the differences between the various classes in the set interface and the map interface as well so until next time bye if you like this video show it by clicking like or commenting or sharing this video we are creating more videos on varied range of topics as we speak subscribe to stay updated thanks for watching until next time bye